welcome, welcome. I'm very happy that you all have come here. So glad. Come here, come here, sit down, sit down. This is the ashram for your soul culture, for God realization. Here I have come the last moment, at the age of my 92. I am also spreading this Kriya Yuga all over America. Now I am sitting here. I let all people come to me and get the God realization by my help. It is very important thing. Thank you very much. I want to give love to every human being in this world. Thank you. God bless you all. Good afternoon and welcome to our celebration of 23rd Foundation Day for Mother Center of Kriya Yoga Institute. Today, some wonderful people have come together to celebrate this program using their many talents. From young Bidita Mojumdar from Austin, Texas, to Bhavyama from Florida singing Madhurashtakam, then Erinma singing Do Not Dry the Ocean. She is performing from Temple of Compassion in Brenham, Texas. And then we will listen to Swami Guru Sharanananji, also from Temple of Compassion, who will lend her voice to this beautiful Oriya song called Chalman Jeeva Chala. So inviting Bidita Majumdar for her song Ramaka Gunagana Kariye. Hello. I am offering this Ram Bhaji to my Guruji, Guruji and the entire lineage of Priya Masters.
ब्रह्मा गुरुर् विष्णु गुरुर् देवो महेश्वरा गुरुर् साक्षात परम ब्रह्मा तस्म श्री गुरव नम अधर मधुर वदनम मधुर अधर मधुर वदनम मधुर नयन मधुर हसीत मधुर नयन मधुर हसीत मधुर अधर मधुर वदनम मधुर अधर मधुर वदनम मधुर नयन मधुर हसीत मधुर नयन मधुर हसीत मधुर हृदय मधुर कमल मधुर हृदय मधुर कमल मधुर मधुराधिपति अखिल मधुर मधुराधिपति अखिल मधुर अधर मधुर वदन मधुर अधर मधुर वदन मधुर नयन मधुर हसीत मधुर नयन मधुर हसीत मधुर वचन मधुर चरित मधुर वसद मधुर वलित मधुर चलित मधुर भ्रमित मधुर चलित मधुर भ्रमित मधुर मधुराधिपति अखिल मधुर मधुराधिपति अखिल मधुर विनूर मधुरा विनूर मधुर विनूर मधुर प्रिनूर मधुरा पानीर मधुरा पाड़ो मधुर पानीर मधुरा पाड़ो मधुरा नृत्यम मधुर सख्यम मधुर नृत्यम मधुर सख्यम मधुर मधुराधिपति अखिल मधुर मधुराधिपति अखिल मधुर गीत मधुर पीत मधुर गीत मधुर पीत मधुर भुक्त मधुर सुक्त मधुर भुक्त मधुर सुक्त मधुर रूप मधुर तिलक मधुर रूप मधुर तिलक मधुर मधुराधिपति अखिल मधुर मधुराधिपति अखिल मधुर अधर मधुर वदन मधुर अधर मधुर वदन मधुर नयन मधुर हसीत मधुर नयन मधुर हसीत मधुर Do not try the ocean of my love with the fires of my desires with the fires of my restlessness 
Do not dry the ocean of my love with the fires of my desires, with the fires of my restlessness. For thee I pine, for thee I weep, I'll cry no more, though mine evermore. Thee I find behind the fringe of my mind, thee I find behind the fringe of my mind. Hide no more, Lord, hide no more. Leave me not, Lord, leave me no more.
for this beautiful song and Bhavya Ma, also Erin Ma and Swami Guru Shananji. Next up, we have Pedi Bhotla family from South Carolina. They are going to sing birthday song in Sanskrit. And then we listen to Vasanta Vasudevan Ma. The song is Govinda Gopala. And after that, we have a very special, beautiful Bharat Natyam dance performed by Malini Vasu from New York with her teacher, Jhinuk Mukherjee from Kolkata. Today is Foundation Day, which means it is the birthday of the Mother Center. In celebration of that, we'll be playing the birthday song in Sanskrit. Please enjoy it. Oh, oh, oh. 
Protect her devil children. One who eliminates sufferings, protects her devotees from evil, and rids them of their miseries. Durga, Durgoti Nashini, Shakon Dukho, Durdasha, Durgoti Dur Karintini. Tai Taan Raghumane, Dike Dike Shankho Othe Beji. Akash Jure Dhuri Dohoi Othe Aogha, Devi Aashche, Ebar Dhara Maache, Nemi Aashbe Shantir Bari.
you to Pedibhotla family and Vasanthama, Malinima and Jinukma for their heartfelt renditions. Let's now enjoy the talented performance of Olin Adams on flute. After that, Sanchari Sarkarma and Pragya Vasudevan. So Sanchari Ma is going to sing the bhajan. Tere tan me ram, man me ram. And little Pragya from Boston, she will sing a devotional song for Lord Narayana. Namaste, everyone. It's so nice to join you all during this Foundation Day celebration. I look forward to seeing everyone soon once the pandemic has passed. I hope you all are well. It's nice to spend a little time together honoring the foundation of the Kriya Yoga Ashram Mother Center in Homestead, Florida. My deepest love to all of you. I miss seeing you all and look forward to seeing you. I humbly bow to all of the Kriya Yoga masters and my guru, Paramahansa Pragyanandaji. I'd like to offer this simple song on the flute in honor of all of the gurus of our lineage, their life and their work, and the work of Baba Hariharanandaji and his work in founding the beautiful homestead ashram for us all to come together to pray and meditate.
Pranam everyone. Today I'm going to sing a Ram Bhajan. Tere tan me Ram, man me Ram, tan me Ram, man me Ram. Rom Rom me Ram re, Rom Rom me Ram re. Ram se mar le, dhyan laga de. छोड़ जगत के काम रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 तेरे तन में राम मन में राम तन में राम मन में राम रोम रोम में राम रे रोम रोम में राम रे राम सिमर ले ध्यान लगा दे छोड़ जगत के काम रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 माया में तो उलझा उलझा दर दर धूल उड़ाए अब तड़पा क्यों मन भारी जब माया साथ छुड़ाए देर नहीं है अब भी बंदे देर नहीं है अब भी बंदे ले ले उसका नाम रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 तन के भीतर पाच लुटे रे डाल रहे है डेरा काम क्रोध मद लोभ मोहनी तुझको ऐसा घेरा भूल गया तो राम रतन भूल गया तो राम रतन भूला पूजा का काम रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 बचपन बीता खेल खेल में भरी जवानी सोया देख बुढ़ापा सोचे अब तू क्या पाया क्या खोया दिन तो बीता दौड़ धूप में दिन तो बीता दौड़ धूप में थल जाए ना शाम रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 तेरे तन में राम मन में राम तन में राम मन में राम रोम रोम में राम रे रोम रोम में राम रे राम सिमर ले ध्यान लगा दे छोड़ जगत के काम रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम 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 रे बोलो राम बोलो राम बोलो राम राम I'm bowing down to Baba and Gurudev and everyone. Vakra Tutta Bahakaya, Koti Surya Sabaprabha, Dirvik Dabkuru Bedeva, Sarva Kadeshu Sarvada, Saraswati Dabastu Prab, Vada Deka Baru Pidi, Vidyarabhakarishyabi, Siddhir Bhavatu Ubesada, Sada Shiva Sabarabhav, Shri Shyabha Charadabhatyabhav, Shri Pratyadadadda Pariyattam, 
पद्ये गुरु परंपरा गुरु प्रभा गुरु विष्णु गुरु देव महेश्वर गुरु साक्षात पर ब्रह्मा तस्म श्री गुरव नम invite mac baba from our homestead ashram for paramans yoganandji song listen 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 followed by soma chatterjee ma from seattle who is going to sing for lord krishna and then we have a very special guest from germany marisa ma most of you know her the great artist from germany she is going to sing a song stone by stone hi everyone it's nice to be a part of this celebration and to be with you as master yogananda said listening is everything and god is the master listener Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. Listen, listen, listen to my Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will. Never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. 
Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. Listen, listen, listen to my song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget thee. I will never forsake thee. I will never forget thee. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Now I'm Shoma Chatterjee and I'll be singing a Krishna Bhajan today. Kripa Saro Hare Kamale Mano Hare Kripa Saro Hare Kamale Mano Hare Krishna Charane Gahi Krishna Charane Gahi Krishna Charane Gahi Lila Purushottam Radha Vare Lila Purushottam Radha Vare Radha Madhava Bhava Bhadha Radha Madhava भव बाधारे शरणागत रहिए शरणागत रहिए श्री कृष्ण चरणे गही श्री कृष्ण चरणे गही कृपा सरोवरे कमल मनोहरे Sarovari Kamale Manohari Krishna Charane Gahi Krishna Charane Gahi Akarishan Ki Kendri Krishna Akarishan Ki Kendri 
श्री कृष्ण सुंदर तम रसिकेन्द्र कृष्ण है सुंदर तम रसिकेन्द्र कृष्ण है कृष्ण कृष्ण कही कृष्ण कृष्ण कही श्री कृष्ण चरण गही श्री कृष्ण चरण गही सदा सर्वमय है सर्वोत्तम सदा सर्वमय है सर्वोत्तम क्यों ना धाए उनको सदा हम क्यों ना धाए उनको सदा हम सकल राभल भी सकल कृपा सरोवर कमल मनोहर कृपा सरोवर कमल मनोहर कृष्ण चरण गही कृष्ण शरण गही श्री कृष्ण चरण गही कृष्ण शरण गही जय गुरु इफ यू वॉन्ट योर ड्रीम टू बी बिल्ड इट स्लो एंड शूरली स्मॉल बिगिनिंग ग्रेटर एंड हार्ट फेल्ट वर्क रोज प्योरली इफ यू वॉन्ट टू लिफ लाइफ फ्री टेक योर टाइम गो स्लो do few things but do them well simple joys are holy day by day stone by stone build your secret slowly day by day you grow to you See 
Somama and Marisama for your melodious performance. Thank you all for joining us all in celebration. Now we will have a message from Yoga Charya Suresh Baba. He is the president of Kriya Yoga Institute. I would like to invite him. I bow to Paramahamsa Yoga Ananda Ji. I bow to Gurudev Paramahamsa Harihara Ananda Ji. I bow to Guruji, Paramahansa Prajnananda Ji, bow to the entire lineage of Kriya Yoga Masters, bow to the saints and sages of all places of all times. I bow to the Almighty God and I bow to all of you. Good afternoon. I am happy that we are able to celebrate the Foundation Day of 2020 online during the pandemic restrictions. We are able to get Sri Guruji's darshan online. We got to see Guruji the day before yesterday during the opening ceremony of Paramahansa Yogananda Ji's coming to America 100 years ago. Yogananda Ji's ship at that time docked in Boston and the Boston Center did a beautiful in-person and online program for that celebration. <laughs> Everything we do this year because of the pandemic sets a new kind of record. A little bit about Miami Ashram. The homestead property was bought in 1997 by the Kriya Yoga Institute. The homestead ashram property used to be a used to be famous as the exotic garden because of the varieties of lush trees, fruit trees, flowering plants, a pond and a small island. This made a perfect setting for a few feature films or documentaries. The original, original property bought in 1997 did not have the real two buildings, two residential buildings. I understand that Gurudev himself went to the neighbor's house and convinced him to sell the property to the ashram. As a result of that, we see the cohesive, beautiful five-acre property of the Kriya Yoga Institute. Gurudev knew exactly what was needed on the property. Once, Yogacharya Elizabeth Ma, Mark Bishop from Columbia, Maryland, and I, along with few other friends, were sitting with Baba. Elizabeth Ma is an architect, I am an architect, and Mark Bishop is an attorney with a lot of development experience. Baba described his vision for the meditation hall. Elizabeth Ma and I quickly took some measurements, sketched the scheme, and showed it to Baba. <laughs> Baba put the sketches aside. Baba was a divine architect and a builder. He took us outside the existing building, guided us to the two corners of the new meditation hall, and showed us the exact extent of the new meditation hall 
which was an extension of the existing building. There, the building was designed on site by Baba. You see, there were some county restrictions on the new building. Mark Bishop knew a local architect who could get the building approved that would fit into the regulations and still give us what Baba wanted. Well, Karen Ma was given the charge of a project manager. She, with love and devotion, coordinated all the work to make Gurudev's plan for the new meditation hall a reality. A lot of hard work. While the construction was going on, Baba used to inspect the construction every day. We used to live in Maryland in those days. As the construction of the new meditation hall started, I got a call from Baba one day. Suresh Baba, contractor is driving on concrete foundation. Is it not bad? I started to answer Baba's question, but Baba stopped me. And he said, can you come here now and check? I couldn't travel right away. I was in the office. But I called Elizabeth Ma. I mentioned to Baba that let me try Elizabeth Ma. She could come. She's close by. So I asked her. She lives in Miami. If she could go check the construction and talk with Baba in person. She did. Things were set right and everything else was going okay. See, Gurudev wanted to have a lotus ornamentation on top of the meditation hall. Like the way Baba himself had built one on top of Sri Yukteswarji's mandir in Kararasham. During the construction, Elizabeth Ma thought of a unique interpretation of the lotus on top of the meditation hall by way of a skylight, which we see over Gurudev's statue in the meditation hall flooding the sacred area of the meditation hall with natural light. Mark Bishop generously donated for making the skylight feasible. Gurudev inspired everyone to make this meditation hall a reality. And with his blessings, Kriyavans from all over the world are able to do a pilgrimage to Gurudev's divine abode in homestead, meditate in his meditation hall, and walk around, study and meditate in the garden that Baba planned and nurtured. This realized master, who was an expert gardener, a divine builder, took Mahasamadhi in 2002 December, just a couple of months after blessing the completed construction of the meditation hall. Gurudev worked tirelessly in the West since 1974, till his last breath on December 3rd, 2003. This divine gardener sowed the seeds of Kriya Yoga in the West like no one else other than Paramahansa Yoganandaji. Traveling to the various parts of the world like several countries in Europe, South America, Canada, Baba Hariharanandaji established several Kriya Yoga centers, ashrams, you know, however, his, his greatest gift to Kriya Yoga community is appointing his successor, Paramahansa Pragyananandaji, a divine spiritual master who nurtured that Kriya Yoga plant Gurudev had planted in the West. To carry on Gurudev's work, Guruji expanded the number of Kriya Yoga centers, groups of Atom, close to 400 within a few short years. Under Guruji's guidance, the number of Kriya Yoga centers and ashrams is probably quadrupled for Kriya Vans to meditate throughout the world. As I conclude, I would like to leave two stanzas from Mundaka Upanishad, beautifully describing the Guru-disciple relationship. Let me read. Pariksha Lokan Karma Chitan Brahmano Nirvedam Ayat Nasti Akrita Kritena Tad Vidnyartham Sagurume Vadigache Samit Panihi Shotriyam Brahmanishtam. When the seeker of Brahman has examined all the different paths to reach Brahman and realizes 
that all those efforts in the world only create karma, keeping one in the cycle of birth and death. The seeker realizes that one cannot reach the eternal, the absolute through such efforts. No matter how brilliant an intellectual giant the seeker may be, one must renounce such efforts and must approach Guru. The one who is living the essence of the Vedas and is firmly anchored in Brahman. Seeker should never approach Guru empty-handed, must approach Guru with some offering with love. You see, in Gurukula tradition in India, the knowledge is always freely given. It is the disciple's duty to make the loving offering. Interestingly, the next, works, next verse talks about the duty of the Guru. Tasmai sa vidvan upasannaya samyak prashanta chittaya shamanvitaya yena aksharam purusham veda satyam provachatam tattvato brahma vidyam. Provacha is interesting. See, Uvacha, we used to, Bhagwan Uvacha, Arjuna Uvacha said, or Bhagwan Uvacha, Bhagwan is teaching, but Provacha means convincingly, decidedly, firmly teaching to that seeker of Brahman <clears throat> whose heart is pure and the external organs under total control. The realized master must systematically, experientially, and convincingly show the path to attain the Brahman through which the seeker reaches the imperishable Purusha, the Brahman. Thank you, and I bow to all of you. I bow to omnipresent God. I bow to all these saints and sages of all times and places. I humbly bow to all the masters of Kriya Yoga lineage. I bow to Paramahansa Yoganandaji, who came to waste 100 years ago. And I bow to living power of God within you all. Divine souls, this year has been a very difficult year for the entire world. No one had even dreamt about it, that how this year would be turning out as compared to normal one. The current ongoing pandemic situation has led many people jobless and with a lot of financial problems. As the economy severely got affected throughout the world, it has also impacted our lifestyle in both ways, positive and negative. However, one of the positive aspects is that people have become more conscious and little bit more disciplined about themselves as well as others. In this time of crisis, I would request you all to meditate more at individual level as per your available time and look for helping others who are in need. Let me share with you a real incident. Vasu and Veena both were studying in medical college. They became friend and after finishing their masters, they got married with the permission of their parents. After marriage, they opened their own clinic, taking loan from the bank. Dr. Veena was a gynecologist and Dr. Vasu was a surgeon. And very soon, the clinic was running well. They didn't have any children. 
after two years of marriage. Therefore, whenever they had little time or vacation for two three days, they used to go to some short journeys to different scenic places. When Dr. Vasu was in college, he had heard from his roommate about a city in central India. Its name is Indore. This city is very famous for various kinds of delicacies in food items. So this time they decided to visit Indore and the nearby city Ujjain to pay homage to Lord Shiva in Mahakaleshwar Temple. When they were about hundred miles away from their destination, it started raining. The traffic was also heavy as they were approaching the city. While passing by a small village, they saw some wafers hanging in front of a mud house. So they stopped to take a cup of tea, thinking it might be a small roadside tea stall. There was nobody in the shop. So they called for someone. A lady came out and asked, what did they want? Dr. Vasu said, we are in hurry. Please prepare two cups of tea for us. And then they took some wafers, some snacks and sat down on the chair inside the room. It was getting delayed. So Dr. Vasu called this lady again that why you are delaying. So she came and explained that she had gone to the neighbor's house to bring some tulsi leaves. And that was the reason for delay. After 10 minutes, she brought two cups of tea, fragrant with tulsi and ginger. Dr. Vasu was little upset looking at the improperly cleaned cups. But his wife, Veenama, she signaled to keep quiet. Tea was very delicious. Finishing tea, Dr. Vasu asked her how much to pay. And she said, just 20 rupees. So doctor gave her 100 rupees, but she returned the money without charging anything. When Dr. Vasu asked her, why did she not charge money? Her reply was, because this is not a hotel and we do not sell tea. Then why did you make tea for us? She said, you are guest for us. And if guest is asking for something, it is our moral duty to provide for that. Although she did not have milk even at home, so she used the milk kept for her little child. When doctor asked what this child would eat now, her reply was for one day, if he doesn't take milk, he will still survive. His father is sick today. Yesterday he had some fever and tomorrow when his father is well, then he can go to nearby market and purchase some milk for the child. Dr. Vasu was speechless. This lady made tea for them using child's share of milk and it was not even a hotel. Just because he had asked for that, he realized that she was more civilized, more educated than him. Dr. Vasu told her, that they were doctors and they offered help to check her sick husband inside the house they went. And there doctor noticed the real poverty and the weak husband lying on a cot. So Dr. Vasu gave him some tablets from his bag and told that this is not enough. 
let me go to nearby market and buy some injection and saline bottle. While Dr. Veena was taking care of the patient at home. After treating the sick man, they had another cup of tea with newly purchased milk and two hours later, when the patient's condition became normal, they thanked the lady and left for their remaining part of journey. Three days later, while returning, they stopped at the same house and they had brought milk and some toys for the child. The family was very happy to see them again. So they had tea together and they had a little talk to each other and it was a new relationship formed. Then Dr. Vasu gave his business card to this lady and requested that whenever possible, please visit our home in the nearby town. After reaching home, Dr. Vasu remembered the words of that lady and decided to help others. So he ordered his receptionist next day in the clinic that when the patients come, just write the name in the register and do not write the fee. I personally will charge fee when they, I, I see them. Since that day, he was not charging money from anybody who was poor or who could not afford. He was charging only those people who were well to do. And slowly, due to this noble work, his work expanded. He became very renowned in the town and around. When other doctors in the town heard about his behavior and his practice, they complained to the superintendent of the doctors association because they were feeling insecure and thinking that they were going to lose their business. And when the doctors association, the, the president of doctors association came and asked for explanation to Dr. Vasu, Dr. Vasu replied that he was always a topper in all his academic career throughout his life. He had earned gold medal in university, but in serving the guests selflessly and keeping a right attitude to help others, that poor lady from village was much ahead of him. And that is why he wanted to serve the humanity because a doctor's duty is to serve the people not making business out of opportunity. God has given this life to serve others. The message from this story is that there is plenty of opportunity to serve others. If you look around, you may find it. Guruji always tells, love all, serve all. So let us try to help others, those who are in need because of this pandemic corona situation. On this foundation day, let us make our foundation of humility, love, compassion more strong. Thank you all for participating in this beautiful online foundation day ceremony. I am praying for all. Om Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Santu Niramayaha Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Makas Chetukha Bhagpavet Om Shanti 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 May all become happy and healthy, loving, noble and compassionate. May there be no suffering and sorrow. May there be more love, peace and harmony among us and in this entire creation. Om. Amen. Thank you all.